Hey everyone, Boom Shaka here. Today I wanted to speak to you guys about something that I'm going to be doing a lot more videos about, uh, a Myers-Briggs personality type. I am an INFJ and if you don't know anything about the Myers-Briggs personality type, basically classifies people according to four different traits um, and you can read a little bit more about it at 16personalitytypes.com or wherever it might be. You can go online and check it out. Uh, basically what I am is I'm an introvert, I'm an intuitive, uh, I'm a thinking, uh, sorry, a feeling person and uh, I'm a judge, judger. Um, and so if you read more about it, you'll be able to tell things about it. But basically what I wanted to speak to you guys about is empathy and opening yourself up. Um, and so I was speaking to a friend of mine recently and he said that um, what happens is that he notices that whenever I come near an individual that's really, really draining or very emotional, um, a lot of times I have to shut myself out. I have to close up my boundaries. I have to stop um, you know, opening myself up because what happens to me is I'm an empathetic individual and as soon as that individual, that draining individual comes into my sphere, that person really takes everything away from me because of my empathy. And basically empathy to me in my own INFJ category means that as soon as I'm around someone who's feeling anything, any sort of emotion, uh, if he's feeling sad or, or she's feeling angry or whatever it might be, instantaneously I am transported into that person's emotion and I can feel everything that they are feeling. I can feel it so strongly. It's as if I am the person who's feeling it. I am the person who's dealing with it. And it's so powerful sometimes that I can, I can be sitting right next to someone and actually be feeling every single emotion that they're going through, the ups and the downs and everything. And after a while, if the person is feeling a lot and they're taking a lot away from me, um, I can be so drained that I have to go home and take a nap because it literally takes away from me. It takes from inside of me. And so what I've learned over the years, what I've learned to do is I have learned to create boundaries. And that is one thing that I implore all of you to learn, especially if you're an INFJ, is that you need to learn how to create boundaries, not only within you know, your heart to protect yourself when you're in a relationship, but in general, a physical boundaries uh, so that you can protect yourself from all these individuals out there who are negative, who are an energy vampires, who are going to take away from you, who are going to be draining. Um, and it's especially important for INFJs because we're so empathetic, uh, empathetic, empathetic, empathetic. But also for people who are not INFJs, but who are normally filled with empathy for all the people around them. People, they feel everything that's going on around them. They're, they care about the people around them and they want to help them. Um, and so boundaries in general for these individuals is gonna be very, very useful. And one of the ways I create a boundary um, is, is just by closing my heart off. And I'll do that in physical manner. So I'll, I'll start, I'll hunch over my heart and I'll protect it physically. Or I will you know, tell myself that I'm not going to feel what this individual is feeling and I really, really try to cut myself off and you know, hold my heart closed so that I don't feel every ray of emotion that this individual is feeling. Because normally it would just devastate me, it would just drain me and I would be, I would be incapacitated for a long period of time until I recovered from it. So again, I, I, you know, I, I wanted to talk to you guys about boundaries, especially for the INFJs out there. It's so important that we learn how to create these boundaries because it's the only way that we're going to be able to get over the hurdles of being around a lot of different people. And we are meant to be around people. We're, empathic, empathic. we're full, full of empathy. We are going to be the ones who are helping the other people around. We need to be around people, but we can't do it for a long period of time. And that's why I tell you that, you know, create those boundaries and learn how to create those boundaries and that's the way you can be around these individuals and not die. <laughs> um, I hope this video helps you. Um, again, I am an INFJ and it's called the Myers-Briggs personality type test. Uh, you can take it anytime online. There's 16 different types, etc. Uh, I'll be speaking more about INFJs in general because I, I am an INFJ and I, I know all the things that I have to deal with and I'd love to share that with all the other INFJs out there. So my name is Boom Shaka. If you want to join my free welcome you to do that. Again, I, I, I wish you the very best and I hope that you have a great week. Bye for now. Have an amazing week.